What's up, everybody? Today we will be going through. What am I looking for? Okay, today we will be talking about two cameras um, the Sony A7 Mark II and the Canon 6D Mark II. Now, before we jump into that, Roll of intro. Okay. Um, so, but I do not. So, what I wanted to mention today. Okay, what I wanted to mention today before we ended up talking about the cameras was that I have decided to challenge myself to create more videos. So I want to post daily videos on either YouTube or TikTok, maybe both. I'm gonna try doing both, but that is my goal for the next, say three months. We'll see how that goes. And if I can do it, great the more people that end up like following me and following my journey that's awesome i do have more things that are, i'm going to be adding to this this will be an exciting new step i i want to <clears throat> do like tech videos as well as like mm, daily vlogs and just a mix of things like because I live in a tiny home I like making videos and I have several things that I want to test so uh, we'll, we'll get into those at a later date but for today let's get into looking at these cameras because they are virtually identical they both have the same specs which I will hopefully be able to put like right there and Hmm. So today we will be looking primarily at like the video shooting aspect of what these cam cameras are capable of. Now they both shoot in 24, 30, and 60 frames per second at 1080p. So that's primarily where we're going to keep the t today's video. And <clears throat> I will do like kind of a one video of the Sony first and then one video of the Canon second. But first, let's take a look at my Sony A7 Mark II. Um, it has the 35 millimeter Sigma art lens on it, which is more for photos, but I'm using it for videos just because it's such an amazing lens. And to compare, I have the Canon 6D Mark II with the 35 millimeter Sigma art lens as well. For audio today, we will be using the Rode VideoMic Go to, and that's just gonna be consistent audio throughout the whole thing. We won't compare audio in this video. <clears throat> Alrighty, there we go. So this is the Sony A7 Mark II. I, I will put the settings down here and basically tell me how you like what you think the difference is here isn't we will switch over to the Canon 60 mark II, which is this camera and we'll basically compare them both unedited unedited but I will primarily be using the Rode mic to record the audio for this now the benefits to both of these cameras is like the pros and cons of each. This has a, um, a flip out screen where I can actually physically see myself on the camera's monitor, which is really nice. I really like that because that's a feature that I wish my Sony had. It only has like a flip, a flip up screen. It only flips like 90 degrees up and down, but I have 
figured out that issue by using a monitor which is really helpful so that's what I'm using to film myself with the Sony okay let me know in the comments below which image looks better but we'll see one the uh, okay so my primary camera has been the Sony a7 mark II, just because I bought that camera this is my spouse's camera so I will not be using that one as much I have to get better lighting oh my gosh okay so now let's hang on I'm gonna shut this one off if I can if I can't figure it out that's a downside to that is that I have to go to the other side of the thing to shut it off whereas I know where the button is on my phone and it's on my screen here so I can shut it off so there's the compare like the quick comparison of the 30 frames per second at 1080p now let's take a look at b-roll and compare which one looks better in terms of filming something in say slow motion I guess that was very loud <clears throat> okay so we're basically going to show the exact same clip twice filmed in 60 frames per second at 1080p we'll start it off in regular speed and then slow it down and let me know which one looks better and which quality ends up trumping the other quality which skin tones look better which one is better overall because b-roll is something that you don't need to film a lot of just because you're not gonna make a whole video out of cinematic sequences okay so here are those clips Let's go over them and see what you guys think. 